There's a new push tonight to make Pennsylvania lead free. Governor Tom Wolf wants state lawmakers to require kids to get blood tested. The numbers are staggering. Only about one in three kids in our state have been tested. A statistic local leaders are hoping to change. It will be what we deserve to give to the Pittsburgh of tomorrow, a complete lead free water system. Today, local and state leaders unveiled a new plan to completely eliminate lead across Pennsylvania. The problem is once we've identified an elevated lead level in a child, it's really too late. Governor Tom Wolf's initiative begins with passing universal blood testing in the state legislature. Last year, Allegheny County began requiring all children ages one and two years old to get tested, a move that seems to be working. We have seen the amount of uh, kids who are, who are getting tested, but also the amount uh, of the levels are coming down. But leaders say testing is just the first step. Governor Wolf also wants to create regional response teams around the state. The teams would make recommendations to address lead, follow up with families of children who have elevated levels, find the source of the lead, and then come up with a plan for how to get rid of it. He also wants to train more people in lead remediation. Here in Pittsburgh, a top priority is eliminating lead water lines to homes, a goal that the PWSA has been making progress on. By 20, the end of 2024, we will have no lead in the water lines of the city of Pittsburgh. Governor Wolf is also proposing a severance task force, a, a severance task, excuse me, for his infrastructure initiative. It's called Restore Pennsylvania. He wants to use that money for projects, including replacing lead water lines. For more information on lead poisoning or on how to get your child tested, visit our website, WPXI.com.